Well, if you're flying out of Pittsburgh International or Arnold Palmer Regional, check your flight status. Yeah, this has been so frustrating. Spirit Airlines is expecting a fifth day of flight frustration for customers. Bryant Reed joins us live with where the cancellation chaos stands at this hour. And Bryant, how's it looking right now? Well, David, the chaos continues as people are waking up this morning, figuring out that they'll have to wait to get to their destinations. If we take a look at the big board, there are still flights canceled for both departures and arrivals for Spirit Airlines. The company says they expect the cancellations to diminish over the coming days, but we're going on day five now and no changes locally. The airline says they're focusing their cancellations where passengers have other options. There were close to 20 flights canceled between Pittsburgh International and Arnold Palmer airports uh, just yesterday. And not long ago, Spirit Airlines issued an apology. They blamed the, the delays on staffing shortages, the weather and system outages, but say there should be less cancellations today. Air travel has been this air travel has been its highest this week in more than a year, but passengers have been left with tickets in hand stranded without a way to get to their destinations. It's a lot of upset people here right now. The man's flying for a funeral and his flight got canceled out of Atlanta. So 62,000 passengers uh, with canceled flights, uh, nearly 50,000 of them because they didn't have uh, uh, the pilots available, trained and ready to roll. Now, in the meantime, Spirit Airlines says they're working around the clock to get back on track, but says you might want to check your flight status and look for notifications before you head to the airport, not just this morning, but for the coming days. Reporting live at Pittsburgh International, I'm Brian Reed, KDK News.